What's up guys, today we're going on a special Craigslist card of haul. This guy is selling his childhood Superman comics, I believe like 300 or something, or uh, a spectacular price of only $20. I'm looking for the street right now. We're near the UW district. This popular area right here. Hey, last us right oh, It's burgers on the left, and you see right there. What's up guys, welcome back to another exciting Craigslist comic haul video. This is episode number 28. I'm so excited, so freaking excited. So this guy who lives in the University of Washington, otherwise known as the UW district, pretty much close to Seattle or right downtown, he decided to sell his childhood collection of mainly Superman comics and he wanted only $20 for that. I decided not to even haggle with it because $20, um, you know, is a very cheap price. But he did quote me. He was expecting it to be $300. I actually did a count. It only happened to be $216. But regardless, if you do the math, that comes out to be $0.09 cents per comic as opposed to $0.06 cents if it was had it been 300 comics, all right? So you see the stacks right here. Some of them were in brown envelopes. As you can tell by the writing, this kid's writing right there. Look at, he did, even hooked me up with some Maximum Carnage, which we're gonna see in the collection, along with, what does it say right here? Superman, Doomsday, do not bend. So I wonder what kind of exciting issues would that be? And right here, see that rain, collector's editions, and legacy of Superman. All right, so that's definitely, um, it's, Childhood collection, let's go ahead and get it started and get a better view of it, right? And as with all my combo hauls, if you see any key issues, which I haven't entered the system yet, make sure you hit me up in the comment section so I will know to treat them with proper respect. So here we go. Hope you guys enjoy it. Here's the stacks and stacks of comics. Let's go ahead and get that proper first person's perspective view. Guys, so you saw the Superman poster wall art in the back. I got to represent, right? So I have to admit, first of all, off the bat, I am not a huge Superman fan. I mean, I dig the comics, but I don't think I've ever become really super interested in it. So let's go ahead and start with the uh, Spider-Man Maximum Carnage series, which I was very fortunate for him to hook me up. This is Spider-Man Unlimited number one. This is the first part of the Maximum Carnage uh, series, which begins here. And Spider-Man Unlimited is one of these... Uh, Thicker comics came out in 1993 that just, I don't think it did so well, but the Maximum Carnage series did. And continuing on, we have crossover to the Web of Spider-Man. You see J. John and Jameson on the front. This is part 2 of 14, and make sure you check out Spider-Man Homecoming. I liked it, but I wouldn't say I love it, and it's definitely not like the 94% that Rotten Tomatoes gave it. I feel that it's more deserving something like an 86 87%. It's definitely not as good as Wonder Woman. All right, we have number three. This is the Amazing Spider Man 378. You got um, Carnage versus Venom, and I heard there's gonna be a new Venom movie featuring Carnage as the villain. Um, all right, continuing on, this is a Spider Man series. As you can see, we have so many Spider Man comics, or at least had. This is number 35. You got, uh, I, I wouldn't say Domino, but that's not him. We got Carnage, we got, that's not Hobgoblin, man, I don't know who that is. Venom, Black Cat, and Spider-Man, oh, there it is, Demon, Goblin, Shriek, Doppelganger, man, all these characters, too many to remember them at all. Spectacular Spider-Man, alright, 5 of 14, Spidey and Venom together versus the Black Cat, alright, so she, he looks like he's gonna rescue her. I haven't read most of these, I have to admit, I probably used to own like, 3 or 4 of the, 14 set and continue on you got a whole bunch of characters a whole slew of fighting going on in the front all right and we continue on with amazing spider-man one you got venom carnage doppelganger demo goblin deathlock things get even wilder no doubt about that and we have looks like um venom is shooting carnage with the sonic ray Actually, that's not a sonic rake. This kind of looks like a 
laser or repulsor array. No more Mr. Nice Venom. Continue on with Maximum Carnage, Spectacular Spider-Man. I don't know who that is in the back. Well, I guess that's the character we named earlier. Alright. Web of Spider-Man, I like this cover. Once again, it features all three characters. The main Spider-Man, you got Iron Fist, okay. By the way, that series pretty much sucked. It started out right, but then it kind of went downhill. i probably give Iron Fist that series, like uh, that TV series, and Netflix series, probably like a 78%. Alright, and we are moving on. Number 12. Okay, so you can see uh, one of Carnage's powers is he can shape shift into different type of weapons. And last but not least, I think I'm missing issue number 13 though of the series. This is the final one, an awesome conclusion, which finishes off in Spider Man Unlimited number 2. Face to face with Carnage and Venom gets the winner. Alright, now we will move on to the um, Superman comics in no particular order, no chronological order either. We have this one is the white polybag version of Adventure Spider-Man number 500. I believe I own quite a few of these. You see it's a collector's edition when it came out it was 295 It consists of all these oh card, poster, all that good stuff. Came out after the death of Superman one which is the black cover one. And then continue on we got these die cut cover ones which came out as a gimmick cover. That's Action 687 Reign of Superman that happened. Here is the Superman 78 one. And 501 from Adventure Superman and Superman Man Steel. I believe I gave these away as part of the comic book giveaway like a couple months back. So I'm not trying to hurry this up. I don't want it to be a super long video. Alright, we got the Legacy Superman. That is like one of these one shots. Alright, that's a good read. I remember reading that. And year one with Doomsday, this 95 annual. Do you see Doomsday looking a little bit different from the movie which they feature? I love all these. Stalactites that like he grows because it's super sharp and stuff and it hurts Superman. We have Superman Annual number 8 from 1996. Do you see the League of Superman? You know, a whole bunch of different ones, even a wimpy one right there. Superman number 100. This is about Centennial Edition, the death of Clark Kent. How many times are they going to kill him? I swear, man. Anything for sale is DC. What's up with that? Action 712 Pressure. All right. Superman Man of Steel 47, Sins of the Father. We have Superman 103, Arc Like Burning. Adventure of Superman 526 right there. Notice um, he has a longer style, <coughs> style of hair after his death. Power Struggle series, all right, with Superman 119, featuring a legion of superheroes. This one is Breaking Through the Chains. Number 120. Man, it's going to be a great read for me. All right, we got 121. This could be a great glow in the dark cover. I have to admit, this is probably my favorite cover so far that I showed. Funeral for a Friend, which came out uh, crossing over all these major DC comics. All right, this is a, a historical cover. I think that's when um, the debut is Superman. Same cover style, featuring Supergirl, though. You got Power Struggles action. You know, it's his new costume right there after his death, his resurrection. And we got um, Adventure Superman 544, Enter Gang is back from Daily Planet. Worlds Collide Superboy, a milestone series, looks like this one. Superman, the Man of Steel, number 64, Into the Sunset. And one of. Uh, I know what's, what Superman loves to do is to kill his villain. Such as, you know, in, in the Justice series, he, he just flies them into the sun and kills them. Nobody can stop him from doing that because he's too powerful and too fast. Adventure Superman, this Revenge Squad. Alright. We got Superman, man, stay blown away. Looks like Tornado is happening. Superman, Revenge Squad in Action Comics 730. That's like a knockoff of the thing, it looks like. I don't know. Any of these characters must be a villain group. Superman Man of Tomorrow Maxima is back. And I believe I have the first appearance of Maxima too. If you know for a friend, continue on with Superman. Another iconic cover, sort of, I guess. Action number 712. Strange Luck. 
Mr. Mixo Mixo Pick. How do you guys pronounce that? Anyway. Action Comics 716, The Trial of Superman. Adventures of Superman. Clark Kent's gone. Who's next? Action Comics 710. Lois Lane getting blown up. Speaking of blown up. Hint, hint. Injustice series. Go check it out. Read on recomicsonline.com for free. Superman, season number 45, End of the Road. He's burning his uh, costume, looks like. Kind of reminds me of Beyonder. Right there with his 90s suit. Superman 101, The Grip of Fear. Avengers Superman, right there. Run for their lives. Action Comics 711. Long Live Superman. Conduit is dead. Okay, who's next? Looks like he's going postal, Superman. Fawcett City Fallout. The Man of Tomorrow versus the World's Mightiest Mortal. Lois and Clark forever. I guess again engaged or whatever. Superman, a man of tomorrow, a great a return of greatness. Oh, when did this series come out? It's a one shot. Weird, I've never seen this come out. Now a new Superman story every week of the year. Oh, okay, but obviously we know it no longer exists. Look at this one. Freaky cover right there. Superman fighting Aquaman. He got. Dark side in the back. This one's finding the Alpha Centurion. It's not even a fight. And this is one of my favorite covers of all Superman. And also one of my favorite Joker ones. This one. Pretty amazing, right? Joker has the uh, super... Well, imitation Superman's cape and costume. Superman and Man of Steel number 49. That kind of reminds me of like a Daredevil pose or Spider-Man pose. You got Superman with Green Lantern, 105, right? I don't really like that cover right there. It's pretty weak. Alien point of view. Man of Tomorrow. Alpha Centurion takes Metropolis. The Trial of Superman. Man of Steel number 50, a special big ish size issue. He's locked down by all these uh, huge chains. That's not a hold of him. Unless it has Kryptonite on him. Trial of Superman 70, 106 Condemned. Another Trial of Superman. Continue on with Adventures of Superman. And 51 Sky Pirates. Uh, Alright. 107 The Rain is Over. Who is this guy? Underworld Unleashed. Big Bug Hunt. Underworld Superman and Man of Steel. Luther is back in charge. If you guys know us, the art isn't the best. Kind of simplistic, right? Adventure Superman 500. So that's the issue to that white poly bag comic. Inside of this looks like that. I'll most likely give that one away. Here we go. Born Again Superman Action Comics. Bonus Last Son of Krypton poster. Reign of Superman. That's when they debated it. Steel. Here is one where he's fighting Doomsday. Doomsday for Doomsday. Got Superborn on the front during the reign of Superman. And we got uh, Hal Jordan. Not Hal Jordan. I mean, uh, damn it. Guy Garners versus one of these knockoff Superman. Steel versus Superboy. And this one is um, a robotic version of Superman. Adventure Superman with. Superboy and Supergirl. Action Comics. Who watches a Superman? Iron John vs. The Last Son of Krypton. Title about two. Things are booming in Coast City. There we go. Superboy is getting his butt kicked as usual. The Reign of Superman. Action Comics. Superman vs. The Army. Not even a competition. And this one is a huge face of the real steel deal. Reign of Superman. Continuing on, guys. We got this black costume silver Superman. Superman Revenge Squad. Shattered Steel. Men of Steel. 
He got a Green Lantern. Oh, that's weird. Alright, so he has one issue of Green Lantern. <laughs> Superman back for good. This is a pretty nice cover right here, number 505. I like the art. It's pretty classy and iconic right there. That's also with this one. It's changing into Superman, Clark Kent is. It's Superman rescuing a uh, child. Funeral for a friend, epilogue. Ooh, first time he's seen that one. Superman vs. Superboy. Tropis ain't big enough for the both of them. Kryptonia no more. And this one, I'm 28. This could be a glow and dark cover right here. It tickles, all charged up. Number 84, the toy man plays with keeps. Blood sport, spill blood, first cut. And uh, high tech system overload with spill blood, second cut. All right, um, what should we do right here? All right, here, here's some good ones, right? So he did have some of these um, doomsday key issues. That's like, uh, I want to say the first appearance in at least Man of Steel. And that's the adventure of Superman, both with Doomsday before he showed his face, right? He was all wrapped up in this suit. All right. And funeral for a friend. There we go. Just like 70. Superman, Man of Steel 20. In memorial of Superman. Supergirl paying tribute along with the Superman Man of Steel Funeral for a friend and 77 looks like he's flying off to heaven the end and check this out guys he put this key issue inside this uh, Bag and board it, you know remember he wrote do not bend so this is this issue number 75 I wonder if this is the first issue. I mean first printing or not because it seems like the later printing ones are worth more Obviously, he took it off the out of the bag, and this one is the first printing. I was hoping for like a fifth printing or something, because that's the uh, highly collectible one. All right, so there it is, 75. A classic cover. Number 85, Cat Grant's Revenge. Number 508, The Adventure of Superman is about time. Challenges of the Unknown. Featuring Lobo on the right. Crazy character. Supposedly he's supposed to have his own movie. They're trying to make him into like Deadpool. I wonder how that's gonna turn out. Here we go, 86. His final fate of Auron. First time he's seen that character. Maybe his first his first appearance is in there. The champion of space. That is a buffed up Superman right there. That's one of the biggest one I ever seen him. <laughs> Bizarro is back. The real surreal deal. Superman's finding Bizarro. Pretty weird character, I have to admit, because he does, uh, I guess, uh, spoiler alert, he makes appearance in uh, Injustice later on, like, I don't know, like a uh, fourth series or something. Fall of Bizarro right there. Oh man, I'm gonna have so many Superman comics to read. At least I'll catch up what happened to him in the 90s, you know. I think haven't really been paying attention to Superman comics. That's like like a Sam Keith art. That is ridiculously buffed up. What is up with that? That's when he took steroids or something? Power to the parasite. This means war. The battle for Metropolis. So it looks like this is the battle for Metropolis um, storyline. I don't know what really happened. I think it's like Lex Luthor versus like regular public people, civilians for Metropolis. Double size anniversary blowout. The fall of Metropolis. So this that one. And somebody dies. Looks like. But not Superman again. And who is that purple character? Looks like Milestone is teaming up with uh, Man of Steel. Blood Thirst. Massacre in Metropolis. 
That's Bloodsport. Kind of looks a little bit like a knockoff Deadpool, right? You got Man of Steel versus a whole bunch of Superman. That's a pretty cool comic right there. That's Zero Hour Storyline, looks like. I'm not that familiar with the Zero Hour Storyline. Avengers Elvis Cheerion. Nothing left to lose. And let me put this, and we're going to get to some uh, slightly more exciting stuff, guys. Hope you guys are not bored. <laughs> Superman is still number zero. That's back then when they DC decided to come out all these zero comics trying to make them sell. You see that? Kind of a little bit like a metallic ink and a zero. Instant buy back then, I think. There's the Avengers Superman one along with the action. So I have all four of zero comics. Beginning tomorrow. Dead again. Looks like, man, they're killing all kinds of Superman. What's up with that, DC? That's a pretty cool comic cover. Dead again. Death Trap. Featuring the Outsiders. That kind of looks like a Batman pose right there. Now, notice the art gets a little bit better right here. Whoever Manly is. Pretty nice art. I believe this is a key issue. I kind of remember that. Maybe Dark Side of the Force. Body of evidence, mind boggling. Virtual reality bites. I love how they create a story name for each comic. That's a, a comic book classic uh, thing. Minefield. Supergirl action comics. Welcome to Small View. Love bites. Here we go into the dragon. Night of a Hundred Thieves, The Dragon Strikes, Love Bites 2, Continue on with Superman number 99, we're at the almost 20 minute mark guys, so I'm going to try to make this definitely under 25 minutes, 521, speed this up a little bit, Mr. Miracle, featuring Mr. Miracle and Agents of Liberty, right here, alright, we got this, Daily Planet, Guy Gun loses it, this one secrets out, alright one more stack, small stack, this one is Supergirl and Team Luther, um, 64 page uh, one shot, the future is now, Superman and Toy Man playing rough, one shot with Doomsday right there, okay, oh man I forgot, I thought I hooked up my microphone, one that's Action Comics, The Trial of Superman. Closing Arguments. The Sentence is Death. Trial is Over. Superman and Demolitia. Snobber Knocker. Guest Starring Batman. You got Guest Starring Spectre. Guest starring Plastic Man. What's up with this, man? It's like guest starring people. <laughs> and Impulse. And there we go, Superman. And Shazam. The engagement is off, folks. Fighting fire on there. 111. Torn up. Toasted. And Mad About You. This one is wet locked. The wedding of Lex Luthor. Adventure Superman right there. You can't kill him with a gun. You should know that. Re pretty nice art right there. Who is that? Johnson, who is? You can tell when they have a special style of art, and that's pretty special to me. Let me check him out. So, oh, maybe that's just the cover, looks like. He's holding up his own sign, and ooh, this one's. This should have been like a prismatic cover. Wouldn't it be awesome? They should have done it like that. 537 versus these cartoonish monsters. Stop Superman, you're killing him. Who is that? Some purple creature reminds me like from Image Comics. Sucker then. Lois leaves. And I need to clear some room. And here we go. Deadly Obsession. And we got 
the bottom city part one and three part two or three i don't know these characters guys part three or three you got claws of the jackal barrage attacks fury in the fortress the final night national whisper lights out two minutes too much stuff to read right there superman 117 who was that? Introducing Pharaoh. From the Metal Man? Well, at least it's a first appearance, right? Crash of Two Worlds. Quest of Lois Lane. Look, up in the sky it is the Adventures of Superboy. Cross out his name. Last but not least, it is Honeymoon Horror, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Another rare Crisis Combo video. Um, make sure you subscribe for more exciting combo hauls along with food and product reviews only on J. Rule Productions. Thank you for watching and I love you guys. Happy collecting.